Major shakeup for St. Louis Public Schools tonight as the board approves an emergency transportation plan for the upcoming school year. The district was forced to act after their bus provider abruptly terminated their contract a year early. Five on your side's Laura Barcheski reports on a crucial meeting with new information on how this will affect students and parents. Laura. Mike and Kelly, one board member abstained from voting tonight, but the rest approved an emergency transportation plan. Consultant says the district has to remove 70 bus routes by this fall. The new plan details these changes. Start and end times will be staggered starting around 7, 8 and 9 a.m., ending around 2, 3 and 4 p.m. High school students will be asked to ride the metro. The consultants say about a thousand students are metro eligible. Parents who can or already drive kids to school will be asked to opt out. They will consolidate stops in areas where it's safe to do so. Some areas won't change for those safety reasons. The district will use vans where they have less students who need a ride to school. We believe that this will result in overall improvements and on time performance. This should shorten trips across the system, meaning that our students are on vehicles for a shorter amount of time. The district already approved plans to work with 19 different providers, including for a student, and will use vans from daycare providers and even local churches. One of the biggest concerns was over safety. The board members raised concerns about the safety on the metro and the buses, but also about the consolidation of stops, making sure students aren't walking too far in a neighborhood that might be unsafe. I, I really want you to consider that when you're thinking about our families, because they're in the thousands the many that don't have a stable place to stay. Please consider that our young people are going to have to go through uh, neighborhoods that they're not going to be welcome in. One block to the next, you could be in serious trouble. Mm -hmm. Parents will be asked to opt out before the fall semester starts so that they can, sol can consolidate those resources to the students who really need it. We'll have a link on KSDK.com where you'll be able to do that. Reporting live in St. Louis, Laura Barcheski, Five on Your Side.